Hello everybody, Brito Guy here, and welcome back to Carkeeper. Alright, so last episode we beat some bosses, did some things, got some lava, still can't fish in this stuff though, because uh, yeah, this fishing rod just isn't uh, good enough. So that means we're going to have to go and get some Galactite ore, if I'm not mistaken. So the only place to get Galactite ore is uh, the desert, and we know from adventuring that our desert is down here somewhere. So we can go down here and check it out. So I'm not sure if it's um, how far down this way it goes, but uh, we do have some of it right here unlocked near this teleporter. So we can go to the teleporter and teleport down and start our adventure and see what we can find in this area. So let's off we go. All right, so here we are in the desert. So we'll uh, check out, see what's around here. What's that? A scarab wing cover. Huh. Maybe you make bombs with those? Very possible, very possible. So the ore in this area, is this the ore? There we go, that is the galactite ore. Okay, so it won't be too hard to find, I guess, because uh, it's going to be everywhere. It takes a while to mine, though. I guess maybe we should look into maybe getting a, a better pick eventually, which would be good. Hey, man. And boom. Oh, yeah. Forgot those guys blow up. All right, so let's just adventure and uh, pick up all kinds of this stuff. And then that way we can use this for a mob farm. That would be really good. And you guys are like ninja throwers. Throw all kinds of horrible crap. Ow. I gotta watch my health. Oh, should she uh, eat a little bit? Get my food up. What is this? This looks like the Galactite ore one. So in order to uh, smelt the Galactite ore, you're going to need these uh, big furnaces. These are the uh, Fury furnaces. So those are unlike I, these ones here. So you got stage 2 1 materials, stage 2 materials, and then your Galactite and your Solarite. And I think there's one more afterwards. So once we get enough uh, Galactite, we can make the next workbench. And then one of the other things I'd like to um, <clears throat> slowly eventually get into is these portals. So that way we can uh, just use them to teleport around to go get our minerals and stuff like that that we're looking for. So that way I don't have to walk there and go pick stuff up. And I don't have to do these really big long chains of, of crap. I can just like put it one down here, teleport there, go pick it up and move it around every once in a while. So that's pretty much all the goal for that. <clears throat> and uh, yeah. So we'll wait till this smelts up and I get a bunch more iron. I think that's all I'm waiting for right now is till uh, we can make some more of these drills. So now, now that we're back here, we have uh, enough drills that we should be able to do a nice little setup here. I did make uh, an extra set of drills just in case, um, ooh, in case we find another one while we're out here adventuring. Because while this is like out here mining, we can still adventure and. Have a look around and see what's uh what's around here right so we'll just do something like this put a generator there and uh i'll just have our ore come down here oh what is that i'll come this way and we'll have it come up Oh, we just come all to one spot. We can just break this wall and... There we go. And we can collect all the ore that comes out here. Perfect. So we'll let that do that. Oh, kind of used the wrong thing there to... Wrong drill, right? There we go. And we'll put this wall back. And we'll go adventuring and see what else we can, uh, we can find out here. I was close. <laughs> nice try, buddy. Get him, boys. Nice. A whole bunch of them here. Nice. Good stuff, boys. 
There's some kind of some kind of cave or something in here. Can't mine it. Hmm. Let's go find the entrance to this place. So it looks like we found the entrance. Oh, this is going to be uh, fun. We're going to have to watch out for traps and stuff. Stone turret. Cool. Oh, shit. Hey, look, there's something in the middle over here. So I guess that's where we, we got to go. See if we can get there. Oh, I think we found it. Got to the middle. I'll have to destroy all these things here. So we don't get shot. Some nice rugs here. Eh. Oh. Almost all of them. There's the other one hiding behind the tree. All right, what's in here, man? Valuables. Uh, a key item. Complex wind-up machine created in honor of a Raka that seems to have a mind of its own. A gift worthy of a young prince. Hmm, I wonder what that's used for. Well, that's pretty cool. And we got another skull value. Valuable skull. Awesome. All right, so let's break some stuff here and see if we get anything else worthwhile. All right, so we made it out of that little area. That was pretty cool. So that's a pretty big, uh, big uh, maze that we found. That's pretty neat. I don't think we really need to go through the rest of it. It was probably just a bunch of galactite chests that were sitting in the rest. But I think we got like the, the main, the main thing, right? Screw you, buddy. I'm talking here. Don't don't interrupt me when I'm talking. That's very rude. All right, so let's continue on our little uh, adventure here and see what kind of other stuff we can get. And we'll just pick up a little bit more ore while we're here as well, right? So I guess this uh, maze was pretty big because it even extends all the way over here. That's crazy. I guess we just got lucky and went in the right spot, maybe. Oh, look at this, ladies and gentlemen. Wow, wow, wow. Hey, a triple friggin' Galactite ore spot. Wow, that's friggin' awesome. Where the hell are we on this map? Oh my lord. <laughs> Alright, so the teleport is right there. So I could just make a straight beeline to it. And make a tunnel there. And we can... Oh man. So we just got four Galactite ore spots. Oh, and uh, there could be another one right here. That could be one, or it could be just a cluster of like uh, ore itself. But uh, we'll have to check that out. Because it does look pretty similar to that. And if that's the case, it means we got quite a bit, a lot of Galactite ore. <laughs> wow. Pretty lucky here, man. We're pretty lucky. All right, so let me set up this area and uh, get some more Galactite ore being mined here. Because that's friggin dope oh shit uh, how do I get out of here yeah I didn't think about that huh shit is there like a stuck setting Uh, Houston, we have a problem. How do I get out of here? <laughs> uh, so that's what happens when you, um, <laughs> and you get yourself stuck in a certain spot. 
That was freaking hilarious. Uh, serves me right for, for doing that. <laughs> All right, let's uh, let's go back and get her stuff. That was just too funny. Wow, that's quite a quite a fleet of guys I got to kill in there. <laughs> Man. I should heal. I need a better heal potion. Oh, what's this? Ooh. I just pick up a new. Oh, I did. Ooh, I got ourselves a new wand. Oh, what the hell? Oh, that's not good. <laughs> I guess that shit bounces or what? <laughs> oh, okay. Danger, don't use that home. <laughs> oh, snap. <laughs> Oh, it was pretty funny. Uh... Alright, let's go to the right teleporter this time. I went to the wrong one and went up here. That's how I ended up getting that wand. Crazy. There you go, that actually worked out pretty good. Now we got a straight B line here. Now I can uh, get my stuff here. Uh, I must have picked up so much crap along the way. Oh well, I'll do a couple of trips and I'll come back and we'll set things up for all three of those. So here we go. Let's set something up here for all of our drills. We will get lots of galactite ore now. Oh my god, I just can't believe I found a triple like this. This is just so awesome. Gonna make uh, make our end game quite good, if I'm not mistaken. We'll be able to upgrade all kinds of crap. All of our all of our gear. All of our weapons. Tools. You name it. We're gonna be able to do it. It's gonna be awesome. Alright, so let's uh try to figure some way out. I don't know if I could power all of them with just like one generator. I highly doubt it, but oh I missed this side. I miss that side. Yeah, probably not. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Oh, wrong one. All right, so let's put uh, a generator here. One here. Okay, so we do it with two generators. That's fine. That's good. All right, so we'll get all this material to where is that? Go down here like this, onto like a main belt. Then we'll have this side go this way. This side go that way. We'll have all you come down here like this. Going up. Have, uh, you come here like this. We'll do something like this. And then we'll have like one collection area, I guess. Okay, bam. That looks pretty good. And we got all this ore being, being mined here. And then uh, we'll wait a while and we'll uh, we'll get some stuff. We'll smelt it all. And uh, we'll try to do a, like a massive upgrade to all of our gear. 
and kind of go from there. So I'll do like a little AFK sesh here. I might um, get a bucket of water and actually do some fishing here and see what kind of stuff I get out of this area. That's probably a good idea. I'll go grab a bucket of water. I'll put like a little pond here and I'll just fish while this thing mines. So I'll go do that and we'll be back afterwards to upgrade all of our stuff and uh, go on for another little bit more of an adventure and see what more stuff we can find here because that's going to be great. Alright, so a little bit of time has passed now, and uh, we got quite a bit of uh, the galactic ore stuff, and um, I think also when I went fishing, this is what I got fishing, these rings are really good, they're max minion count, and uh, the attack speed of the minion, so I might actually change out for the ones that we have, this is lifespan and minion damage, so I might just see if I change both of these out. And then now we should be able to have like six minions. That's pretty sick. We got this double ring. It would be good for a ranger or a melee. And we got a bunch of chests and some cards here. And a whole whack of fish. So it was about like an hour and a half. Maybe two hours of fishing. So uh, it wasn't too, too bad. So we'll put these away. And uh... Alright, so now that all that stuff is put away. Let's uh, go and upgrade our table. Um... I stood there for a while, and like I said, about two hours, we got a lot of galactite ore. And um, also, uh, we have like five nodes over here. So we have this one here, we have these three here, and this, I went and checked it out, it is another node. So I have to set something up around here, and we'll have five nodes of like galactite ore just all in one little area, which is pretty intense, pretty intense. So now that we have that, we can get rid of this. We'll put that table down. Now see what we can get in here. A go-kart workbench. That's kind of cool. The next hammer. We can get a trap. A turret. Oh, that's kind of neat. And then a solarite workbench. That's kind of cool. So this is one of the things I do want. Bam. So that way we can fish into that lava, hopefully. And then... 517... Yeah, this is like way better. Interesting. <clears throat> I do want to upgrade my pickaxe eventually too. And uh, hopefully we can do something with that. So anyways, we'll get rid of that for now. Uh, this I can break down. Bam. Get rid of that. And then <clears throat> let's upgrade some armor here. <clears throat> All right, so we'll start by upgrading uh, this, I guess. It'd be safe to upgrade my armor first because I want to go and start trying to do some bosses now. There we go. So how much do we have left? Got 190. All right. Uh, we'll do our book. Oh, we, uh, do, 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 what else? So it's just the range that went up. All right. And then do we dare upgrade this thing? Oh, this thing is so dangerous. This scares me, this wand. Because it, like, it rebounds and it can actually hurt you and hit you. And it's, it's absolutely horrible. All right, so we got all that upgraded, which is good. Um, eventually, I'll go and I'll upgrade all of our fishing stuff, too. I'm not sure what gets upgraded. Just have a look. Chance to get fish on the hook. All right, so that's actually pretty good if we were to upgrade all this kind of stuff, too. Because then we have chances of getting uh, more fish. Good stuff. Uh, I wonder if that goes up, too. Chance bait will not be consumed. Goes up. And this one here, your fishing and your rarity goes up. Okay, so it's worth upgrading this stuff too uh, over time, which is kind of cool. All right, so let's go find out what we need to... Actually, I wanted to test this out. Uh, one, two, three, four. Let's eat. Five. Oh, this is going to be awesome. Six minions, baby. Woohoo! 
<laughs> oh, yeah, six. Yeah, two, four, six. All right, I was trying to see if there was a seventh, but we got six. All right, <clears throat> so now we need to find out what the next boss is, huh? Uh, I'm assuming it's this one right here. So we need ancient James. Okay, so those red things I was finding on the ground, we need 40 of those. Oh, that's going to be quite the hunt. All right. <clears throat> Uh, they also have a molten boss, so we need magma slime. So we're going to have to go hunting for that kind of stuff. All right, so let's go back to the desert and hunt for the magma slime. And we need those 40 scarab things. Um, let's go see how many I have. I think I only picked up like two or three. Scarab wing covers, yeah. So we need like 37 of these. Oh boy. All right, so let's go farming with like six minions. That's going to be awesome. <laughs> Oh, I love it. Oh, snap. Oh, 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 dodge, dodge. Holy crap. Ouch. <laughs> See, that thing is so dangerous. <laughs> I ended up killing myself. Ooh, a black desert diamond. guys down there. Ooh, what's this crystal area? That looks pretty sick. What is this place? Better not die. Hmm. It's uh, very dangerous to my health, whatever it is. <laughs> uh, I'll have to check out to see what the hell that thing is. That's pretty neat. Very cool. Oh, nice. I wonder what this is. A little volcano area. A little, little oasis. That's pretty neat. I like this. A lot of spawning pads in here. I found this like lava cave. Ooh, this is kind of cool. Alright, let's keep our eye out. Got all those chests. Mining damage, mining speed, burn damage applied on hit, and some valuables and stuff. Nice. I think the chest looks pretty cool. Alright, looks like we're going to need some blocks to build, go through here. Oh, those are the slime I guess we need, huh? This is neat. Underground railroad thing. It's in the chest. Some bomb stuff and some valuables. Nice, nice. That's just a pole. Oh crap. Smithing glove, damage against bursting targets can be equipped off hand. That's pretty cool. Nice. Oh, 
shit, there's a lot of them in here. My god, there's so many. Pretty good, it's pretty good. There's just a bunch on the other side. Oh my god, there's so much. Oops. Oh, I'm running in a circle. Oh shit. Alright, let's get in here and get some revenge. Nice, all right. Now let's concentrate on getting the boxes. Dum dum. Oh, it looks like we explored the whole of the lava cave. Doesn't seem to be anything too, too uh, special here. So we'll uh, continue on in our adventures and see what else we can find. Oh, what did I pick up? A prehistoric crystal spear. Oh, that's pretty intense. I'll keep that on my uh, on my person. <laughs> Ooh, a bomb scare mortar. That's pretty neat. Fourteen hundred mining damage. Huh. <laughs> Interesting. I really like this thing. <laughs> That's friggin' dope. I like that. That's great. I think I just found my new best friend. Oh, looky, looky what we found. Found another Galactite ore thing. That's pretty sick. Should really heal him myself. Wow, we're pretty lucky on finding all these uh, nodes. There's another one down here. A lot farther the, from uh, our little setup, which is up here, though. But still, it's another one out there. Oh, snap. Get away from me. No. I'm too young to die. No, please don't. <laughs> oh, it's good, 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 good. That's one of those crystal biomes, though. Can I shoot into that? I can. Well, this is really cool. This is the turn of development. So it looks like we can get into these places just by shooting the walls. Unlike uh, before, where we couldn't mine it. Now we can. It's a little bit slower, but uh, we can hammer our way through here and get to different areas in, of this place if we wanted. Which is really great. Okie dokie, so a little bit of time has passed here, and um, I was running out of health potions and food and all that stuff, so I decided to come back to base, and I did a whole bunch of fishing, and I also um, up here made kind of like a temporary mob farm for uh, slime, because uh, running around after those things and trying to farm them out there was a little bit of a pain in the ass, so I came out here and I made this little slime farm up here it's all the different types of slime so most of the magma slime is on this side and then i got purple i got yellow i blue blue and i got the normal slimes so i got each one of them in there <clears throat> and because we had all of these um turrets i decided to throw them in as well and they don't damage each other so even when they do crossfire they hit each other and there's no damage numbers so it doesn't seem like they hurt each other so we've been getting our slime from here we're still missing quite a bit even though i afk'd for like uh i think it was overnight so like that that ran for quite a while and we still didn't get like a whole ton uh but from what uh we did get we got a bunch of chests so we opened up like 38 of these things and we got like all the paladin armor, the assassin's cloak and uh, all kinds of other crap down here. Different types of rings, 
And then here we got all kinds more armor, the paladin, minor stuff from fishing and all kinds of tools and crap like that. So down here also what we got from our mob farm was this um, grim armor set, which is better than the armor set that we have on here currently. So we're going to go and trade this out and we're going to upgrade them. And uh, yeah, so that's going to be pretty awesome. Uh, from fishing, we were able to get these different types of food. Um, so this is just mushroom soup, so that's just fruit for food, food when we want to run it around and I don't want to use buffs. Then we have um, that same fish that we were using, the emerald fish here or whatever, for, for this one. And we mixed it with a... Uh, what the hell is it here? It's a dagger fish, I believe. Yeah, so it's a dagger fish, and that gives us that uh, that uh, the stuff here. All right. And then at the same time, too, we made a mining one. So this one's good for mining. And then this is just like another damage but with thorns and i don't know if that's going to be applicable to me i don't think so i think it's just like melee damage but it just says damage right it's, it doesn't say i'm any particular damage so i might try it and see uh, how that goes right and if it helps boost our our damage that we're actually doing so yeah and then yeah and that one was the minion damage too so yeah we got new foods anyways so that's really good and the because i like afk overnight we got so much of this galactic ore it's like insane insane and then we got like that in there plus i've been afking again this morning <clears throat> and uh just to try to get more stuff more slime balls because uh we only have do, do, do. we only got 86 we need 120 so we're still missing 34 of these like uh so we got to do a little bit more afk to get those and that's going to leave just enough for us to get this thing for the boss here right the molten boss and then we're still missing uh where's the other one and yeah this one right here the scarabs we're still missing lots of those scarab pieces, right? So um, we'll have to figure a way to get them. Because you can either find them on the ground or kill the guys that are, like, blowing up. And we only got nine, so we're still missing, like, 31 of them. So we're still missing quite a bit of those. So I'll probably end up going out in a bit there and uh, seeing if I can find out any more. And uh, find more of those. And hopefully with a little bit more AFKing and running around maybe in the desert... Um, we should be okay but i have to stick around like the farm area here for a while so that way the slimes can go because if i go to the desert area i could be probably way out of the 208 yeah because this circle is like the the spawn radius if you stay in the middle everything in this area will spawn um but if i leave this area nothing's going to be happening over here so it's going to be kind of counterintuitive for one for the other so i'm going to do one at a time and see how that goes so we're going to stick around here for a while do some afk and try to get some more slime and see how that goes but uh this is taking a lot of time to make this episode <laughs> but it's all good man it's all worth it it's uh better than me just running around and and trying to wait for the actual spawns and but uh, I'm not discovering anything at the meantime, too. You know what I mean? Like, this is everything that we discovered. And I will end up uh, going out here and trying to discover more. It's just for now. Well, we're just going to try to do one thing at a time. And hopefully that leads us to where the boss is. And then we'll kind of go out from there. It'll lead to more exploration, right? So after a little bit of AFK time, we managed to get all the slime that uh, we needed in order to get this thing. And it's this guy right here. Bam. Wonderful. So now we can scan the world to see where this big bastard is. Because I'm curious. Let's do it. Let's have a look at our map here. Ah, he's way over here. So, on the other side of the, uh, the temple. Alright, so let's go down that way and find out where this guy is. And beat him. But at the same time, too, we're going to have a little trick up our sleeve this time, I think. I wanted to put this on the ground. Um, put them that are slimy here. Uh, this time around, we're going to use uh, this. And what this is going to do is hopefully he won't attack us because we're going to be the king of slimes. So, yeah, anyways, um, we'll go put this stuff away and we'll head off down that way.
So, uh, so much time has passed that the, uh, the spots that we had here for mining out the, uh, the galactite is all done, by the way. Also, down here uh, was the other one. That one is all done. And I put the drills around this one to finalize that one. <clears throat> so we got lots of uh, galactite. That's not uh, a problem anymore. So let's uh, keep going on with this. Also, another thing we got before uh, while fishing um, was one of these things out of the lava, a Starlight Nautilus. We ended up getting like a whole whack of them, but you can only eat them. Well, you can eat them more than once, but the this max health effect is only a one-time use, so we can use this and gain more health. So we'll do that. So now we got a lot more health, which is great. So I've obviously been on my way over there. And I found another card on the ground. So that's pretty awesome. Got another card. I don't know what these are used for, though. We'll figure it out. Um, I came back home because I needed more tools, and I remembered that. So I wanted to grab uh, tools and health potions. <laughs> you know what I mean? I kind of forgot all that stuff when I left. But now we're good to go. Let's go. All right. So we're right above the slime now uh, over here. I tried looking for a teleporter around here and I couldn't find one so there might be one hidden somewhere around here uh, there might not be I don't know <laughs> but I looked and I couldn't find one so um, I think what we'll do is we'll put this on and we'll put that on and then we will lose some minions I think Let's see how many we get here should like eat at the same time Okay, so I'm still getting five. That's pretty damn good. All right, let's see if we can... Uh... None of these guys should bother me then, right? Technically. Yeah. That's what I thought. There you go. So none of these guys will bother me in here. We just gotta sit here and attack them. That's great. Makes life so much easier. Gotta worry about the mobs around there shooting at me. That's about it. There you go. Does that not hit him? It doesn't. Interesting. Wow. Okay. These projectiles don't seem to affect him either. like I can't affect them either. It's just my minions. <laughs> Interesting. I'm trying not to die here. We'll just keep summoning minions and we'll just beat them, I guess. <laughs> Strange. I have enough bloody potions. Are you guys gonna attack them, though? Like, how come they don't attack now? Get rid of all that crap there. Oh, still nothing. But they should be able to attack them. That's kind of stupid. Wow, they really nerfed that. They, I thought they were supposed to be able to attack them. You can't even attack them anymore. What the bejesus? Well, that's not right. Hmm. Interesting. Well, I really don't feel like taking off this because it's going to be a real pain in the ass. Well, I could go from farther away and just cheese them out, but rather not. Are they attacking him, though? Let's hopefully it is time. Let's just try to keep the minions focused on him. And they're done. That's it, really. I don't get that. That's stupid. Alright, well. What do we do? Let's go get some traps. 
All right, so we're back here. So let's have a little bit of fun with this. Um, can we place traps around him? He jumps? No. Is it because there's stuff underneath him? No, you can't place traps either. Interesting. Place traps around him. And then he just breaks them. Alright, that's good to know. Good to know. Hmm, what else can we do here? There we go. Oh, he's either really pissed off or he's dead. Oh, he's really pissed off now. We're gonna, boys. Alright. Oh, and he shoots fireballs. That's great. We should be okay like this. Oh, that was uh, really impactful, actually. That really hurt. It's crazy how bad that hurt. <laughs> clean some of this crap up. Ah. Ouch. Alright, so I've done some playing around and some screwing around with this guy. And, um, I don't know. I, I'm almost thinking about the best bet to beat him is just to cheese him out. <laughs> because all the minions spend more time attacking all the, the spawn mobs that keep spawning in. And instead of the boss. And then you spend more time running around just trying to heal yourself and um, and pick up the, the crap that he spawns on the ground all the time. So I'm just going to go with the good old I'm going to cheese you and beat you like that mode. And there you go with some cheese. We cheesed him out and we beat him. And it was like probably the best way. Just because, like, I'm tired. <laughs> I don't feel like running around. I did it for about maybe, like, 15 minutes or 20 minutes earlier. Trying to run around and, and get them with the, the minions and everything. But they're just they're just constantly attacking everything else. So, uh, we got a burn Zooka. And that was about it. So, yeah. That was that boss done. And I think that's it. So, we'll head on back home. All right, and that's where I'm going to call it for today, everybody. Uh, I know we cheesed out the boss there, but his arena was a little bit of a pain in the ass. I could have probably filled up the the lava spots with, like, blocks while I had the the king slime stuff on. But uh, other than that, I, I won't be able to cheese out the, the main boss like that at, this, at that level. So we'll have more of a battle that time. But uh, I hope you enjoyed the video, everybody. Like, subscribe, peace, take care. And we'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Oh